What's up, guys? My name is Justin, and I am not sure how I should feel right now. We are back on iRacing for some Formula 1600 fixed at Lime Rock Park. Literally three minutes ago, I finished recording a uh, Formula V race at Lime Rock Park that you saw um, yesterday on the channel. So that was a very interesting chaotic race and i expect more of the same from this we basically accidentally finished third even though we could have had a chance to fight for second um if i was trying um it was either win or you know go home basically for me and i'm gonna take the same approach here i expect death this car is a little bit more tricky to drive a little bit faster still just a 12 minute race so probably 13 laps would be my assumption uh, maybe 14 depending on how the splits cycle out and stuff don't know how strong the draft is here like in the v it was strong enough to get runs down the front stretch but not like huge runs we didn't really make up any time but i'm not going to ruin that go watch that one it was fun yesterday and obviously watch this one because this is hopefully going to be fun as well so got about 30 seconds and uh then we'll hop right into it <laughs> i have never driven this car i'd driven the v briefly and ran a couple practice laps i've never driven this car i have no idea what i'm doing at all in the slightest so we're just going to wing it see what happens no idea same deal probably going to start in the back and just kind of be safe All right. We are ready. Let's join up. I definitely need the practice. Yay, yay, yay. And then we will, uh, I'm going to try to get a GT4 fixed at Laguna in later this afternoon for a Wednesday video, which will be tomorrow. Hopefully we'll see how that plays out. Um, no promise. Uh, looks like I'm still the number... Nope, Martin is in here, so... We're going to be the number two car in this one. Again, we're going to start in the back. I have no idea how this is going to go. No idea what I'm getting myself into, as usual. But that's kind of the fun, isn't it? That's that's part of the fun. We are ready, though. If nothing else, we are ready to eat shit. <laughs> we'll see how it plays out. If we die, we die. Again, in the V just now that I recorded. I won't spoil it, because it is still going to be a good watch, even though I already said how it finished. Um, we accidentally gained 20 eye rating, basically. <laughs> Started 11th out of 12 by not qualifying passed i think three cars and got the rest of freebies so there were like four crashes um so yeah pretty pretty boring race but it was interesting to learn how it worked i had a good battle for a second with a guy uh, we worked together but just weren't able to make up any ground and uh, i drove off the track looking at my phone my mom is really really sick um so she's been like puking all day so i wanted to make sure she was good and wasn't dead so i looked at my phone down the front stretch and drove off the track so that's a stupid one x that i'll never get back <laughs> Cost us any chance to gain gained uh, gained SR, but it's all good. It is all good. We are ready. The loading times are still absolutely abysmal because why wouldn't they be? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Come on. Let's go today. Come on. Maybe. Come on. We're getting there. We don't. You don't have any time to freaking warm up anymore with this, the way they have this now and the loading times. Like you need all three minutes of the warm up to load in the damn session. Yeah, 20 seconds left. It's ridiculous. <laughs> 121 degrees. All right, let's get my brake bias set up here. We want purple. I don't know why. Probably doesn't make a difference. 56 is what we're gonna go with. I have no idea if that's correct or problematic or we're gonna die. No idea. Oh, I 
Okay. Again, 12 minute race. Not even going to bother going out. I guess we'll just practice our start on the uh, leaving the pit road. 55 dead. Is that good? Seems like it's pretty fast. I don't know. We'll practice our start here on the leaving the pit lane. Looks like it hooks up well enough. Damn, I did it again. I did the same thing. I'm so used to like just driving out to start Q. I don't know how to like intentionally take the black flag. All right. So obviously, this is a little bit faster. Not crazily faster, but a little bit. Ooh, that's not slide. That's slippery. Much more slippery than the B. Carrying more speed. I remember that we're not driving the B anymore, even though it looks similar. Don't know what I'm doing. Any brakes up here? Eh, at least a lift. Ideal. Just a slight lift down the bottom of the hill, even so. All right. First quote-unquote time lap that we're not going to use for time. It sounds cool. It feels like it's a good-sounding transmission. It feels very natural, very fluid. I like that. Slide. Deep entry. We're running a similar pace around here to the Mazda Cup car, I guess. Rip. I say that now, almost drive right off the track for no reason. It's roughly 56 dead there. Which is not fast, I know that. <laughs> Maybe starting last year we'll be more in the ballpark of where we should be. say maybe we'll do it again. I don't really want to. I kind of give some of that irony back. We're not intentionally tanking or anything. Just trying to get 
a little bit lower if it happens. Race other stuff, more fun content for the channel. Race other stuff so that we can be more prepared. Race some more of the BMW LMDH to be ready for Watkins in a couple of weeks with the guys, but possibly. It's not 100% that I don't need to be in the car yet. We'll see how it works out. But uh, if nothing else, I want to be prepared. So setups are good. They're ready. They're built. They're good to go. Pending feedback, we're going to need some testing. Looks like we're going to have this session end short, which is fine by me. Alright, let's go. We are starting 11th out of 12. Well, I'd like to see it there. Oh, the six, uh, six cars not even here, so we're not going to be last. We are slower than everybody, though. <laughs> okay, we'll take it nice and easy on this start, because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. All right, here we go. Uh, we won't need tires. We won't need fuel. Obviously, if we're crashing and getting fuel, that's a problem in itself. Looks like fuel's pretty tight up there. About a tenth of the bit between top three. So hopefully it's a good race for all of them. Maybe we'll see them. I like this snakeskin scar. Scar? Snakeskin car, excuse me, next to us. I think that's what that is. Appears to be what that is, like a boa constrictor or something. That's pretty sick. I like that. I like it a lot. Alright. Here we go. Actually, a good start. Looks like we're the pit starter. Six or the eight car, excuse me, from sixth. So I guess we're already up to what ninth then, technically. So. It's cool. Get a little bit of tire heat and just chill. No. Not drive off track, please. Thank you. Not spin out would be good. Big slide and let this dude go. Big slide up over the hill there. Just carried a little bit too much entry speed, I think. Oh, big time arrow plow. Okay, okay, okay. Justin, <laughs> chill. Let's see if this dude goes for a big dive here. Who else? I'm just let him go, I guess. Whatever. Okay, really sloppy first lap. Two big mistakes, we got away with them, we didn't die. We're back to 11th, where we probably should have been anyways the whole time. So. Okay, bro, we're good. Still alive, that's all that matters. Death will occur somewhere at some point, I know that. It may be me, but it'll be somewhere at some point. Oh, there's one off. I'll stay over there, yep, in the fence, okay. It's one. Another one over there, he's gonna come back. No, he's gonna stay over there, it's Jeff Jensen. Fast early, so that's two spots back. We're back to ninth. Okay. Reset. I think we may have speed on the 10 car here, so we'll see if we can work our way up towards that. We don't really match the 8 car, it looks like. But once I've kind of gotten my shit slightly more together, I tear off there while we're in the corner. That's always smart. Oh, not die there. This car does not like curbs, does not like edges of grass. Not a lot do, but this car definitely does not. I can slide this car more than I think I'm comfortable with, but uh, not as much as you know, a true slide like you can a stock car or anything, so I think that's kind of cutting me out. Uh, just a little bit. We're still okay though, we're still not dead. Uh, okay, we're good. It's so scary. It, it loads up there when you crest, uh, hit the bottom of the crest kind of, and it it's very scary. <laughs> Alright, 
we're down to 55 fives that's at least in the ballpark of the tail end of the pack that's reasonable I can live with that I think we can run faster than that as well still about what seven eight tenths off what the pole lap was but I can live with that Actually, it's upsetting the balance. Maybe I need to just lift off in there instead of breaking. Or maybe I'm just dumb and suck. I have no idea. It's okay. We're still cruising. Starting to concertina up a little bit in front of us. The front four have definitely gotten away with this next four is right up here for the taking. Might be some drama. Looks like we're just a little bit slower, not too terribly much, but a little bit, which is okay. Hopefully, they get to fighting a little bit here as we get down to the ladder end of this thing. Again, I think it's going to be roughly 13 laps or so. They stop using brakes in there, it's really getting scary. shallow but we almost ran over the dude not quite actually got a pretty good run off of that with that wider entry <laughs> unintentional of course but it happened big slide there from the car ahead better run through there for us actually we just about break even that's a good recovery by the 11 car Five. Interesting. 
Yep, that was sloppy too. Bleh. Okay, don't die. We're good. Oh, ten far behind, just ate shit. <laughs> Alright, well that pretty much secures his eighth place if we don't make any mistakes. Cool with me. Something I'm not knowing that I'm doing or not doing. I didn't feel like that was particularly special or anything. Who knows? Tires, that was a very big slide in the turn one. So, again, we're not going anywhere. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know why I'm trying so hard to just go nowhere. Hopefully, Colby and Lewis have a little bit of tangle. A spot or two. Uh, maybe freebies, but we're not getting anything else. We're not catching this guy. We're not fast enough to be in range of anything else that happens. So, we'll see. There's time left. Eighth isn't too bad. Considering my literally zero laps and lack of pace, I think that's okay. Still good bad with the front though between the five and the three. One's falling off just a little bit. Got the hiccups as I usually do. The question is, are we gonna get back in time to have a one more lap white flag? Probably not. We'll see. Just maybe. back a little bit here, we're not going anywhere, stupid to make a dumb mistake, crash the car at this point, so, this car is definitely more lively than the Formula B, obviously, um, I can't say for sure if I prefer it, it's, uh, this track is a pretty mad law track, so, I can't judge off of this track whether or not this car is better or worse, but uh, it's different, more lively for sure not get the white flag there, so. Must have been really close, based on the math I just did in my head there. Really, really close for getting the white, doesn't matter. Now it's the white flag. Again, this is fixed, so no worries about fuel or anything. We're more than good. Still good, bad luck for fifth. I can still see this guy in front of us. That's, I guess, something. Well, from the lead, looks like it's intense. Let's see if it's going to be Hugo or Paul that pulls it out. Probably tough to make a pass here versus an experienced driver. I always found that in the Pontiacs as well. There's really only one real passing zone on this version of the circuit down in turn one. Uh, so an experienced accomplished solstice driver that knows what he's doing is very difficult to pass here, uh, which is both played in my favor and against me. <laughs> so, All right, one more turn to go. Nice and smooth, nothing crazy. We're going to grab a P8 finish out of 12. Good, right here you go. Not wonderful, but uh, it's good enough, I guess. 
we'll take it. Could be worse. I didn't die. Zero X. We'll try not to pick one up here on this cool down lap. shifter. Alright, we'll take Alright, we'll uh, get out of here, check the results real quick, wrap this puppy up. That was enjoyable. Maybe not my favorite car ever, but it was alright. Give me the results, please and thank you, of the race. There it is. Thank you, thank you. Alright, clear these out of the way. Pretty good SOF. Lost 53 ironing and .06 SR gain, so that's what we were looking for. I'll take that between the two races, so. Back under 3,700, which kind of sucks, but, you know, is what it is. Uh, we were very slow. Fast was 54 dead, <laughs> and we were 55 dead, which I thought I was happy with. I guess 54.7 was kind of cute pace um, before you get some tire heat, but, uh, yeah, whatever. All right, well, that was uh, that was enjoyable, at least. Um, hope it was an entertaining video. Was I the slowest car in the whole field? Yes, I was. Okay. So I'm the only one that didn't run something in the 54s at some point, so... We were close, not quite there, so we probably didn't even deserve to finish where we did, honestly. But that's all right. You can't have them all, so that'll be it for today. Make sure you drop that like and the sub down below. Don't want you to miss any of the action from iRacing, NASCAR Dirt Today, Tone, Need for Speed, Hot Pursuit 2, or anything else I may post. Try to get a GT4 in later. That's kind of the goal, so we'll see if I'm able to get to that at some point, and you'll see that tomorrow if that's the case. But until next time, bye-bye.